brain. Hurry up, kids. We're going to be late. Coming. Happy Bootsville Day, Dad. Happy Bootsville Day, Coop. Boot shake. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's packed. Barbecue coals, giant pancake flippers, spare boots. Hmm. Oh, bug repellent. Well, we can't forget that or the mosquitoes will have us for lunch. Got it. <coughs> Bootsville's founder, Jean-Guy Laboots, own secret recipe. Did I ever tell you I almost got to play Laboot in the Bootsville Days reenactment? Only about a hundred times. Overcome with hunger and mosquitoes, he loses his boot in the murky swamp. But did he give up? No! Laboot fought off those pesky insects and went on to found our beloved Bootsville. Yeah, I didn't get the part, but uh, this year, I'm finally gonna see a Burton burger behind the beard. Gentlemen and cat, the star of today's festival, Millie Burton Burger! Da 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 da! Today is a good day to swat the insect! <sighs> I still don't get why they let a girl play Laboot. Her audition was the best, although yours was pretty, uh, memorable. <laughs> After months of brave exploring, I, I jumped in Laboot! I'm lost and hungry! <laughs> <laughs> Do I get the part? <laughs> Look out, put itching powder in my costume and... You can't blame overacting on the cat, son. But you've still got a very important job. Mosquito Wrangler. Think you're up to it, sport? Up for bouncing the mosquito while Millie takes the glory? Sure. <laughs> That's the spirit. Ah, uh, my two stars. Well, my star and her behind the scenes one Coop of X crew. Coop, some people are born for the spotlight, like me, and others are stuck holding the bug, like you. I just can't go anywhere without my adoring fans recognizing me. Maybe if you stopped autographing everything you see. All right, guys, hands out. Yeah! Ah. Nothing says buzz off better than Laboot's bug repellent. Ah, your turn, Mr. Cat. Hey! Ow. <laughs> Just wait till the mosquitoes start biting. Then we'll see who's laughing. Hey, Coop, I thought I smelled you guys over here. There's plenty to go around, Henry. Uh, none of that goof for me, Bert. I've got my own high-tech answers to the mosquito problem. Mosquito netting, mosquito finder, and my homemade bug zapper. There's my little star. Hi, Mrs. Munson. Or should I say, Madam Director? More like Madam Dictator. Burton Burger, all you have to do is wiggle the mosquito while Millie yeah. beats the tar out of it. So don't mess up. Let's see. You three, you've got a giant pancake to make. Get moving. Yes, ma'am. Step aside. The star of the show is coming through. And their brother. <laughs> Take out your dressing room, sweetie. Do you need anything else? Oh, nothing. Except the cushion, a makeup mirror, and swamp berries. Peeled. <sighs> well, what are you standing around for? I'm a mosquito wrangler, not a butler. You can't expect a star to get her own swamp berries. <coughs> no, ma'am. Then hop to it! <laughs> Keep the mosquitoes away, Henry. Uh, hey, Coop, what's up? I'm fetching swamp berries for Bootsville's newest colossal mega talent, Millie. And don't forget to peel them! Ew! What? Swamp berry syrup doesn't stop itself? Coop, we're 
confused. Do we call you Cat Boy or Bug Boy now? <laughs> ha ha. How does it feel to lose the starring role to your little sister? You know, the Mosquito Wrangler's a pretty important part, too. <laughs> <laughs> that does it. Where are you going, Coop? Does it matter? I'm just the guy who bounces the bug. <laughs> Next year, I'll show them. I'll be the best Jean Guy Laboot they've ever seen. <laughs> Should have gone for the bug repellent, cat. <laughs> Bigger this year. They are bigger this year! Ah! I told you, Henry, should have used the bug repellent. No! Get him! I think they're done being told what to do.
Way to go, son. Those were the most amazing mosquito effects ever. Thanks, Dad. Martin Berger, nice job with the special effects. You're in charge of mosquito wrangling every year. Uh... Hello! Star of the show over here. Bravo, Millie! Yeah, good job, Millie. You make a great jean Gila boot. Thanks, Coop. <laughs> How about a little bug repellent, Cat? We wouldn't want you getting bitten again now, would we? <laughs> you know what? The mosquitoes are pretty big this year. Maybe you need a little more. <laughs> a challenge for Master Chef Burtonberger. Yow! Nice! Yay, Daddy! Woof! And now the sausage shuffle! Hup, 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 hey! <laughs> Next up, the toast toss. Yay! Daddy, we're out of fishy frisky bits. Again? Are we feeding a cat or a cat army? <laughs> toast is up! Dig in, kids, before it gets cold. <laughs> Coop, I know you're a growing boy, but you could have saved some for us. But, Dad! Cat! Cat, I know you took those sausages. <laughs> Nobody messes with a Burton Burger breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> nice belly flop. What's the matter? You little out of shape? Too fat to get up. <laughs> Who knew fatty foods would stop the attacks? You can't even move. Dad, Millie, check out Cat. <laughs> Holy cow! Literally. Hmm. According to Let the Fat Out of the Cat, unless Mr. Cat's a baby walrus, he's seriously overweight. Oh, don't listen to him, Mr. Cat. There's just more of you to hug. Looks like Mr. Cat could use a little workout. We'll have him thin again in no time. Hey, Millie. You know what Mr. Cat needs to help him with his workout? Energy food. <laughs> Whoa! Mr. Cat likes human food. <laughs> Who's ready to fight some flab? Mr. Cat is! That was just a warm-up, Mr. Cat. You've still got some sausage to work off. <laughs> go, Cat, go! You can do it! <laughs> and one, and a two, and a three! He's actually losing weight! <laughs> I gotta keep Cat fat. Hey, Millie, Mr. Cat's doing great. 
He just needs a little motivation to shed those extra pounds. But aren't these bad for Mr. Cat? He needs energy to exercise, doesn't he? Are you sure? Absolutely. Mr. Cat want a treat now? <laughs> oh, yes, he does. <laughs> Good boy, Mr. Cat. <laughs> Eat up. You'll need your energy. And hop up. <laughs> How does that feel, Mr. Cat? <laughs> oh, yeah, you're doing great. Feel the burn. <laughs> After all that exercise, Cat should be slim, trim, and back destroying anything remotely valuable in no time. <laughs> Not if I can help it. Wow. We could run around to him for exercise. Wait a minute. You've been rewarding him with these? Well, no wonder he's the size of a whale. From now on, Mr. Cat gets diet cat food. Daddy, Mr. Cat thinks it's yucky. Well, Mr. Cat should have thought of that when he was stuffing himself like a turkey. Cat, I'll take care of you. It's counting down to something evil. What the heck is that noise? Bad, Mr. Cat. No fishy, frisky bits till you lose weight. We're going to the store to get more cat food. Tofu flavor. <laughs> Ew. I think we're going to need professional help. Here, sweetie, let's put Mr. Cat in the kitty carrier so we can take him to the vet. Uh, nice and easy. Come. Come on. Come on, come on. My back. Maybe Mr. Cat will be happier staying at home. Okay. See you later, Mr. Cat. Bye. I know all about your evil plan. Well, the details are a bit fuzzy since I don't know what meow, meow means. But whatever it is, you're not getting away with it.
I don't know what you're doing raising kids like that over the fence. Oh, Hello. What have you been up to? Uh, I can explain. Couldn't just sweat the weight off Cat without destroying the neighborhood. Ugh. Oh, gross. <laughs> Good. The fat is melting off Mr. Cat. Boy, carrot sticks, Daddy. Don't mind if I do. At this rate, Cat will be back to his old self in no time. <laughs> Good will have lasted. <laughs> <laughs>